Welcome back again guys, it's me, the guy with redstone skills back on my youtube channel with another holy redstone belt, okay, uh, yeah, um, I should actually control myself because I'm ridiculously out of control while I'm making videos, now, you know, I'm back after a lot of time because I was having problems to record videos for a long time, but now, now I'm back, um, I shouldn't um uh, yeah i should be regular on my youtube channel but you know i cannot for some reasons uh um yeah just let's start so today is a video on the concept of the world's most smallest the world record is the world record for the most tiniest yet the fastest quintuple piston extender for bedrock edition Yes, obviously for Bedrock Edition. You heard me right. B E D R O C K Edition. Bedrock Edition. It's extremely fast, 100% working, and the most tiniest redstone you have ever seen. Okay, now what redstone I'm going to show you, show you may not understand because a lot of geekiness of redstone, redstone is going on here. It's, it's, it's a lot of, lot of hard things going on. Um, I will just turn to the side and promise me you won't actually just say it's not that compact because it's extremely compact. It's the smallest design ever designed for bedrock edition. Bam, that's it. That's that's all of it. This two white glass and redstone line is for extension and behind all of the observers are just responsible for the retraction process. I might not have just show you this thing in action just but just see see it. It's extremely fun. The extension is lightning quick, you won't get it when did it extend and retract. My battery is again dying, you know my battery just keeps dying. But I think you must have seen this. This was extremely quick for a quintuple piston extender. You know how my original quintuple used to look. I cannot even show you, but if you want to then let me show you. Now don't say anything, okay? Don't say anything before I show you. The, this was my original design for the quintuple piston extender bedrock edition which is now pathetically broken mm, here it is yes all of this redstone for just extending and retracting five blocks um, I don't know how did I design it back then it used tons up and tons of observer and is not at compact at all like my present one all of the redstone line behind is responsible for retraction and everything front is for but now my design for the quintuple piston extender is extremely small and lightning fast previously that used to like uh, 50 minutes to just retract I mean 50 seconds 50 seconds to just retract but this one is lightning quick be sure because these kind of piston extenders work on micro decks and um, uh, if if you have like lag on your device like mine it might get broken because you need to have a, a powerful device to actually handle all of the redstone at a time 
because it's just happening point 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 zero point 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 one second after one retraction happens this is extremely quick seriously quick 100 percent working and there is nothing hard about the redstone but everything is extremely hard to place like let me show you now you say this night might not be that fast because you know pistons in bedrock edition are extremely slow but in java version they are lightning quick okay let me explain you how is this happening we have a observer under every every of all of the repeaters and another observer coming out of that observer to detect that and sending that into a block with a torch on top of it this will do the first retraction for all of the five piston well now is that done you need to come down okay here in this box you cannot see but there is also again a torch which gets an update does for the second one third one fourth one all of them are covered in boxes so you cannot see because i made this to be extremely compact this since there this gets updated this gets updated this and the two tickets from signal here so that it can retract then for the third it happens it goes into here pulses the piston it powers this thing and for the third retraction this updates this updates this updates and uh, and for the from the last one this one goes up here powers this uh, sending a signal up here and sending a single signal down here and this has been detected from here to here to here to here for the for the retraction before the last retraction now you can actually improve the design how let me show you you can improve the design but it slightly gets out of sync like you can see all of the blocks are fitted in here no blocks are getting out of this area but if you want to make it more fast you have to sacrifice it or this doesn't get proper i tried doing this and the dust there but it will power that or this piston and will again pro cause problem the only thing we can do in this situation is was this thing to make it a bit faster but slightly out of sync As you right now seen that due to lag it broke okay i didn't break it um that was due to lag because of lag keeps broke breaking it well whatever you you know the concept now right you know the concept but i prefer to be it in sync you know when lag happen this thing breaks remember that but still it's fast how fast do you need it to be okay and pirate stone was is seriously seriously simple there is actually nothing complicated going on and you might notice there are some hoppers these hoppers are empty nothing is in there why do we use hoppers and you might also have noticed what kind of texture pack it is this yeah i updated my texture pack and 
you know this is very hard to work with i can know when the hopper is unlocked and when it's locked it's very easy it's very easy to tell you know every professional redstone applies this so i also applied this just only for the observers pistons and for the dust other than the repeaters and other things are just kind of the same you know never do that never accidentally break your redstone contraption it's still okay everything happened lightning fast in front of you and you cannot tell when and how did that happen yeah that's that's how redstone works it's hard but when you start loving it you start loving it it's you know it's kind of the thing i've been seriously enjoying doing redstone videos well if you want to know where did i get my uh, texture packs from i got them from bedrock tweaks um, yeah like vanilla tweaks for java version there is also bedrock tweaks this is the same thing for bedrock version uh, you know that sort of thing okay if you want any tutorial on this thing i may show it but today i am not feeling to show it because you know if you guys only want to then i will do it for you what the hell did it start raining again yeah I actually keep forgetting the commands yeah the, so that's the video for today guys um uh, i hope you guys enjoyed uh, and yeah the 1.16 has officially nether update has rolled out i'll be leaving the beta you know updating every time it's painful and uh, okay i'll, I'll be updating it next day uh goodbye bye for now take care <laughs> Goodbye